living room. I have my girls with me and our puppies. Girls, say hi. 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 Yeah, Isabella is on my left and Jordiana is on my right. And we have our puppies here with us. Or do you want to introduce? This is Liliana Hart. Um, she is a Chihuahua Terrier, but we call her Lily. Yes, she's our rescue puppy we've had for a few years, and she's so awesome. And then you all know this beautiful baby girl right here between me and Isabella laying on the couch. So cute. Oh, she's giving me kisses. Thank you. This is Antonia. Antonia Hope. Um, she's a beautiful yellow lab and, and my amazing, my amazing angel. So I'm truly grateful for my beautiful girls um, who are truly my everything. Um, and so grateful for Antonia, my husband, who's not down here to do this video with us. <laughs> um, but truly, just truly blessed, aren't we girls? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And Thanksgiving is about looking around you, your life, and just seeing all the beautiful blessings that you have. Not focusing on what you don't have, but focusing on what you have. And girls, what's some of the things that you're grateful for this Thanksgiving? Oh, I know we're both very thankful for our family and our puppies. Maybe each other and our friends. Yeah. Are real close. Yeah. yeah. And then, we're, Georgiana, what's one of the things you're right now you're grateful for? Um, my medication working. Mm hmm Georgiana has been on a new treatment for her juvenile arthritis. Uh, she's been on it since July, and uh, she's been a part of a research study for a new drug, and it is finally working. So we're so happy because we, nothing is more difficult than seeing your children suffering um, pain and you have your, your, you still have your days where things are hard but it's getting better for you uh -huh. so we're praising God for that <laughs> but anyway I hope you guys are having a wonderful Thanksgiving wherever you are enjoying so much yummy food with your family and friends we are looking forward to that as well mm -hmm. my husband is an amazing cook and and, cook. and Georgiana is learning how to cook too and she's amazing just like her daddy Isabel and I we're the cleaners <laughs> <laughs> someone's got to we gotta, we gotta, someone's got to clean up right so we clean they, they cook we clean right yeah, yeah. <laughs> so George is cook and the joys is clean. Yes. so right <laughs> <laughs> so good so Georgiana and George, George and Jordy are going to be cooking tomorrow, so that's going to be fun. I'm so excited to eat all your yummy yeah. food, turkey, mashed potatoes, um, of course, uh, we'll see, macaroni and cheese we're going to have, sweet potatoes, sweet potatoes so y'all want to come over? Y'all come join us? <laughs> yeah, just come, to, it'll be so much fun. <laughs> but anyway, so we just um, wanted to tell you that we love you, and I am so grateful for all of you, um, my my Facebook, my YouTube friends. Um, I love you so much, and uh, you don't know how much uh, you mean to me. As I have inspired you through all of my videos, um, you have inspired me uh, to keep doing the videos and to um, and just to keep being me. Um, and so I just want to thank you from the bottom <laughs> of my heart. Um, I've gone through a really rough season. Um, Gosh, the past five months, I uh, was dealing with skin infections. I'm almost healed from them. Thank you, Jesus. <laughs> it's been a long road. <laughs> it's been hard having the girls for mommy. And um, I have just been, you know, talking about Thanksgiving, being grateful. I have had to choose joy and to count my blessings and find things to be grateful for because when I've been going through so much, it's really, really easy to be discouraged and, um, you know, it's, and to feel, you know, just, you know, a sense of hopelessness at times. And, um, but when you count your blessings and you keep your eyes on, on God and, and, and his promises, you know, it helps you to move past the pain and move past the darkness. I've lived through that. I mean, I've had to choose that um, for the past 10 years of being completely blind and all, really, all that I've gone through. And, um, you know, and it, it hasn't been easy, but I have I never given up, and um, we I'm getting so much, so much better, and so I'm thanking Jesus today um, that you know, um, yes, that it is getting it's getting so much better, and um, I'm seeing the light at the end of the tunnel. <laughs> I am, and so, so you know, whatever you're going through today in your life. I just want to encourage you to never give up. Keep looking around you and finding things to be grateful for. Finding things 
um, to be joyful about. You know, I say joy is a choice and is an attitude of the heart. And even though you may not feel joyful in this moment, um, that you can find something to be joyful about, mm -hmm. right? I have had my girls and my husband and these puppies to um, to make me feel loved and um, and they they when I'm weak they make me strong and of course God gives me strength and um, so that's truly what I'm grateful for and um, another thing too is even though you can't maybe see things changing in your life just start thanking God in advance that's what I'm just doing you know as I've been hurting and as I've been dealing with these infections for so long I just say God thank you. Thank you. Even though I don't see things changing as quickly as I would like, um, even though I, I, you know, I'm still hurting, God, I just thank you in advance that it's my healing's coming. The better days are coming. I see them. Believing is seeing, right, girls? Mm -hmm. yeah. Is that what we always say? Yes, Not seeing is believing, but believing is seeing. Mm -hmm. And um, then we truly believe that God um, has got amazing things in store for you. Um, you just have to. Just keep believing, okay? And, um, you know, another thing that's going on in our family uh, right now that um, it's really hard to talk about, but um, um, my mom, uh, some of you have seen in some videos of ours, um, singing videos, she was just diagnosed with cancer. <laughs> my mom was diagnosed with uterine cervical cancer um, a couple weeks. I haven't said anything yet. I've just been um, waiting to get more details in. Um, she's having surgery on December 1st. <laughs> she lives in Tennessee, and so we're here in Oregon, and it's hard not to be there for her. Um, but even knowing she has cancer, you know, I'm still thanking God in advance. Right, girls? Mm -hmm. We are speaking life. We are speaking healing into my mom's body into this situation we are just speaking God to to move and to bring her through stronger and more victorious and completely well right girls mm -hmm. I'm not letting my mind our mind go to the worst because that's where we want to go our minds want to naturally go but we are just keeping our minds on um, God's promises in his word and we're speaking that and claiming that over my mom's life so please keep my mom in your prayers I love her so much Anyway, even, even though we are still going through difficult times, right, I know, I know who holds our hands, I know who holds tomorrow, and that's God, and I'm so grateful for God's love. He never will leave us, and he'll never forsake us, right, babies? Right. Anyway, we love you so much, and we pray God's blessings to pour upon your life today and for the days and months and years to come. Anyway, you guys have a beautiful and blessed Thanksgiving, and we're going to have lots of fun and enjoy lots of yummy food, and, and then Christmas is coming. Yay. Yay. <laughs> we're so ready for Christmas, so yeah, you might see our Christmas tree we got put up behind yeah. us, and uh, we are uh, going to be decorating our tree soon, so yeah, bring on Christmas now, right? Yeah. All right, you guys, we love you. We're going to finish out um, this video with a song. All right, we love you. Bye. 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 I just want to say thanks, 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 I give you 